What is going on guys? My name is Ron, back again from Roman Reviews here, and it's actually a little bit odd for me to be in front of a camera. It has been, what, almost three months since I've done this? Actually, almost, yeah, longer than three months. Um, I was actually about to prep, starting up my stream, and I was thinking about it when I was heading home, and then I got home, and apparently the Persona 5X trailer dropped. But it's leaked. Atlas doesn't have it up on any of their sites, so I'm wondering if this is not an at at Atlas-based game. Well, like, they're not. it's not being developed by them. So I am really curious, but apparently this is real. If it's not, well, I'll delete the video eventually. But apparently this is a real thing, and someone had uploaded the trailer with subs. I don't know a single thing about this. Apparently it might be a mobile game. That's about all I know. Will I play it? Yes. Why? Because I'm a mobile gamer, and I love Persona 5. Um, yeah, I don't really have much to say. Uh, the person about uh, the person who uh posted this with English subs is called Content Savant. He says, More than welcome to use the video, just give him a shout out. So, thank you, uh, to you who made it. I'm not gonna assume your gender because <laughs> it's current year and I'm not allowed to do that. But, Persona 5X trailer with English subs. I'm curious to say the least. So, without further ado. Let's go check this out. Start in three, two, one. Let's jam. I'm still Sega. Okay, so Atlas is on this. Why haven't they posted this on their channel yet? So he's in the velvet room. I think that's a guy, right? In the velvet room, there's Igor and... Who is that? Who's the, who's the uh, adjutant? Is that a... Blackwing Game Studio. This is a mobile game. Kemi! Yes, best girl, I agree. Oh, there's so much going on. I'm gonna have to pause this. I'm gonna watch. Hey, EY! Okay, so. Alright, I'm gonna really need to focus on the, um. On the. What the fuck was that? Oh, is it a female? No, it's not. Oh, there's just so much. I'm gonna have to rewatch this. What the fuck? この先が窮地のパレスのような慌てないで別のルートにするからシャドウ来てるその手腕は賞賛に値する何でって言われてもねやりたいからとしか言いようないけどな運力は時に君が君自身を放棄することにもなりうる Huh. 
Okay, hi, Joker. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I mean, Nikkei is nice and all because of reasons. Um, we're gonna have to run that back. We're gonna have to run that back real quickly. Because there's a lot. There's a lot. There's just a lot. Okay, so... This can't be canon. Nothing about this seems canon. It doesn't make sense. I mean, it, this could be a sequel, but Mementos is gone. There's absolutely no way, especially after the events of both Persona 5 and Persona 5 Royal, Mementos is gone. So, they can't go back all the grand so they were able to re retcon some of it with Persona 5 Strikers. But then, I never finished Strikers, so I don't know how that ends, but I'm assuming that's the same thing. The whole Mementos or um, Shadow world, um, that's Persona 4, but you know what I mean. Um, is gone but there was just a lot of stuff so I wasn't able to really focus so really quickly so we have this dude I'm assuming this is a guy but maybe not I'm not sure I'm not sure anymore but in the velvet room with this girl we don't know okay so she has the same hairstyle as I believe King Arthur in fate with that the bun in the back. Um, we got Igor. And if this is fake, one, that there's way too much just to fake this out. This could be a mod, but there's a lot of stuff in here. Like, if you look at the, um, if you look at the minimap right here, there's a couple new things that are just new. Like, I've never seen the, uh, it looks like one of the, like a machine, like a conven um, convenience machine. Never seen that. Or the 24, I've never seen that actually have its own icon. But, I mean, as you can tell from right there, it is a mobile style, which is very interesting. But, she kind of looks cute. Actually, she is cute. I mean, I, I, I've always liked sh short hair girls. Um, but, yeah. But, yeah, we did get to see Takemi. And, yep. Best girl. I agree. I agree. OP. Completely agree. Um, front row girl student. So we don't know her name. And as per usual, has a completely different uniform compared to all the other ones. Kind of like like On does. Um, so there, it looks like they're using the exact same layout as the school in Persona Five. Um, we have UI, of course. Ooh, hold on. Did you see that? That's a flail. And are those nightsticks? Holy shit. Okay, so we got a saber. We got a flail. It looks like night six cuz these are melee weapons. So I want to it looks like a it looked like a re, uh, launcher like a rocket launcher at first, but no. It was got to be night six or billy sticks or whatever they're called. Um that's just a metal pipe and I can't tell what that is in all honesty. That might be like uh, uh something you hold on your hands and it's a blade. Maybe don't know what that's called. Um but yeah, so yeah. Yeah. Uh, is there anything here? Okay, there's a few things. Uh, I think Ogekubo is the ramen place. Uh, the park. I don't know what this one is. Shimo Kitazawa? Don't know that one. Yong Jaya, okay. Uh, I know there's other words pronounced in it, but I say Akasaka. Um, Akasaka Mitsuki? Don't know what that is. That looks like... Funny thing is, that kind of looks like, um, the TV station. Uh, only reason why is because I see satellites. Zoshigaya, don't know what that one is. Ichigaya, I'm pre- uh, that one sounds familiar. Um, Sui- Suibashi? Suibobashi? Can't really read that, really. Sorry. Don't know that one. Um, again, then that's all we see. That's over here. Alright, so really quickly, um, so back into the, the, uh, Gyudon, the Gyudon full, uh, bowl restaurant. That's an owl. So, that's the mascot. That's gotta be the mascot. Because, 
from the character that we saw, it's an owl. So that's got to be the mascot. That it's like the our own Morgana. Really cool. By the way, the shadow makes it, the shadow effects make it look like this girl has a five o'clock shadow. <laughs> um, his name in Chinese character spells that Luffy or so maybe Luffy, Luff, Luffy. Anyway, that's a very interesting looking mascot. So we've had can't say anything about the first two. We've had Koromaru and three. We have Teddy and four. Morgana and five. So we've had a dog, a bear, a cat, and now an owl. When are we getting a fox? I'm calling it. We're getting a fox and eventually one of them. Um. With the weather this good, you can't help but want to exercise. So I, I have a, I'm, I'm getting some chia vibes from her. Just a slight because short hair likes exercising. I'm assuming. Yeah. I can feel a never before seen overwhelmingly strong desire coming from your body. That sounds uh, like a pickup line. That sounds like a pickup line. Um, we got the fish in place. I uh, can't really see anything, any other things. That would be funny if you could see Kawakami in the background. Um, batting cages. Uh, Big Bang Burger. That character right there looks a little bit like too stand out ish. Maybe, but yeah, I mean, not as not compared to this one, and we don't know who this girl is. Tomoko is that her name? Tomoko. Okay. Um, it looks like this is our villain. Okay, yeah. Oh, you can tell. Okay, yeah. See, I, I like it. It has the goggles wrapped around the neck. See, I couldn't really focus on everything. It was hard reading the. Um, reading the subtitles and everything. I missed both. So, like, I'm not an owl. My name is LeFair. Okay, so. Obviously, it's going with the same style as Persona 5. I'm not a cat. And then this is, looks like to be the main villain. Kuichi. No, sorry. Kyuchi. Interesting. M Mementos. D I pause right when he's dabbing. Great. So, this... Is that like a sedan? It looks like a sedan. Oh. Yeah, it looks like almost like a sedan. Or a taxi. But the character, the main character's uh get up is very reminiscent of Joker's. Um long coat, uh has red accents in the gloves. Oh, the fingers are actually... The finger part of his hand part glove thing is red. Um, but not the actual palm and the very fronts right here. So, very reminiscent. In fact... There's just a lot. There's a lot. It almost does kind of look like a sedan, almost. Oh, also, uh, I will play this. That is a fucking cool persona. That is a cool persona. But it looks, I mean, it kind of does look like it would be for, like, some chibi style of uh, mobile style. But that's actually fucking dope. Um, I'm assuming that's Tomoko. That is a really interesting drip. I want to see more of it. Kyuchi Stadium, so yeah, so the K Stadium, I'm assuming. So brand new place. He has the exact same. They're reusing the asset, um, assets because it's the exact same running style of uh, Joker. Okay, so it is the same. It's baseball. So I'm, I'm guessing this guy used to be a baseball. Uh, prodigy. So we had a volleyball prodigy with Kamashita, and then now this guy. Oh, yeah, look at look at the uniforms. It's definitely baseball. If you look at they still have the more uh they have the more gone at all those signs. But yeah, same thing. Um the running animation, the victory animation, exactly the same. Uh that is honestly kind of a cool drip. That's a cool like look for the villain. Um yeah. I mean we know that baseball is a huge um is a huge part of Japan. 
Oh, that's cool. Like, uh, shoot, what are they actually called? The back. It's not an umpire, but yeah. I don't know who that voice is. Also, the MCs. Oh, went too far. That is a interesting looking persona. So, can't tell exactly if that is a shotgun from the looks of it. Because I don't know many weapons that have that kind of a handle. And it's that long. I mean, it could be pistols. But yeah, that is a very unique looking. It's like a, it's a mecha. It's another mecha. So we have the owl mascot having a mecha, but this one's a different type of mecha. I'm actually really cool. I actually like this design. That is a dope design. So. And we get to see a little bit more of the this protag's fit. I do like the belt in the front. I think it's kind of cool. I do like how the, um, the collar comes above his uh, mouth a little bit. I, I, I'll i give it that. Kind of wish it was different colors besides the dark gray and black, but yeah. Um, so I'm not sure what this one, this move is. It might be like a... Um, so I'm thinking these are kind of like the all-outs, all-out attacks. And then we get to see his all-out attack. Oh, sorry, not all-out attack. His um, it's the uh, it's the move they use. Wow, I'm totally drawing a blank. It's the move they use. Um, it was only, it was exclusive and brought in on Royal. If the enemy or your own health um is really low, it'll activate. Um, I know someone's gonna probably point it out, or I'll remember. But it's go beyond. It's a very, it's, it's actually really interesting. He has these these freaking these glasses almost reminds me of a slightly like what's that anime girl in the gone slightly not as pointy not as fucking ridiculously long but very similar and then we have another character yo hold on look at look at that persona That's a dope looking persona. It's a fencer. That's actually kind of cool. And then this girl. That's. It's a lover action. No, hold on. That's a bolt action. Look at that. That's a bolt action. Although. The bolt's up on that for some reason. Should be, you know, down and back. Hold on. Interesting. Okay, so a little bit of a better close-up of her with the words run on there for some reason. Interesting. Oh, that's a different persona too. Right? I don't see... Interesting. But yeah, so instead of completely black like Joker's is, it's gray... It's almost like steel. It's like a. It's a darker gray, but with black accents. Very interesting fit. I am really just curious on this. Really curious. Can you waifu these girls? Because Tomoko already looking to be pretty... Like, she kind of reminds me of Chie from her style, and I'm assuming her personality is probably going to be relatively the same. You got to see a little bit more of a playful side, especially at this end. Kind of... I don't know. Tomoko is looking great. Um, yeah, I'm really curious on this one, in all honesty. I'm... 
I want to know more, so maybe we'll know more answers soon. Um, if anything more significant happens, I'll talk about it. But yeah, absolutely. I'm going to be playing this game in a heartbeat. 100%. Um, but anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. I know I've been gone for quite a long time. Um, will I be doing anime content? Probably not for a while. Uh, not until I get more settled in. But, yeah, I am doing good. Work has been crazy. Life has been good, though. But, yeah, uh, come check me out. Uh, if you've seen this video, I'm probably live. If you, if I, if I post this video and you're just not watching it. Um, but if not, uh... Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. I have been streaming Fallout 76 during the time of this recording. So if you're interested in that, go check it out. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.